a little over halfway through this Independence Day 2022 with the live look across downtown Macon at this hour. We're looking at temperatures in the upper 80s and low 90s now across the area. 89 with a 74 degree dew point right now, making it feel like 98 degrees outside in Macon at this hour. It's 90, the actual air temperature in Milledgeville and in Gordon right now, 89 in Cochrane and 87 in Wrightsville. But when you factor in the humidity, here's what it feels like. 100 in Milledgeville, 100 in Forsyth, 100 in Cochrane, 98 in Macon and in Warner Robins. Feels like a toasty 99 down in McCray right now. Now, we're starting to pick up some activity here on the radar. A uh, shower there in southern Butts County. A storm trying to get going there in parts of Lamar County near Zebulon. This is going to be the story of the day. You're going to see them bubble up real fast and then collapse as they do so. In fact, we saw one in northern Monroe County at the top of the show, and that has since gone to bed. All right, so an unsettled pattern across the southeast. No secret about that. But as we head into the day today, we're going to see more of this. Here we go into the evening hours. Fireworks time across many communities here in central Georgia. Notice we do still have some locally heavy downpours here on future view. Could see some gusty wind, some small hail, and definitely some lightning with those. If you hear or see lightning, that means it's time to head inside because you're close enough to be struck by it, even if it's not raining at your location. But all of that to say, don't go canceling plans tonight because anything we see will be short lived on into tomorrow. We're going to do the same song and dance and then you guessed it for Wednesday. We're just going to keep on doing this with this summertime pattern, although the rain chance is not going to be as great as they are today. As we head into the weekend, though, the rain chances will begin to pick back up back to about a 40% chance of rain here in central Georgia. So the rain chances going down for a few days. The temperatures coming up forecasting a high of 95 for Thursday and Friday after a high of about 93 degrees today with those afternoon storms. A few of those could be on the strong side. Sunset tonight is at 846. So if you're planning on doing your own fireworks, it's going to be dark enough for that right around nine and then completely dark right around 930 here in central Georgia. But before we get there, the heat index going to be another story today going to feel like 100 plus for the next several hours here in central Georgia. So if you're spending any amount of time outside, something to keep in mind is heat exhaustion and keep watch for signs of that. Even if you're going to the pool, even though you're in the water doesn't mean you're drinking the water. At least I hope you're not drinking the water. All right, here we go. 80s for the fireworks tonight. Scattered showers and storms here in central Georgia. Again, don't go canceling your plans. No reason to do that. It's going to be a warm stretch of days, though. As the temperatures come up, the precip chances go down, down to 20% for Wednesday, 30% for Thursday. But then we rebound when we start the weekend on Friday. A high temperature at 95 before we are down to 89 for next Sunday. The average high for this time of year is right around 92. So at least we're in the ballpark.